What's going on to YouTube? It's your boy Big Stu. It's time for another spectating solos, man. Make sure you guys smash the like button down below and subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. Because over 90% of you guys who watch my videos are not subscribed. What's going on, man? But with that being said, let's go ahead. We're going to get into this game and see exactly what type of lobby we have here. Let's get it. All right, let's see what type of lobby here we got go again. So, look, I get two shots, two chances to win this. Hey, if I lose it, if I win this, if I win this gulag, you have to subscribe to the channel. Hey, a deal's a deal. I won the gulag. You got to subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel right now. Let's get it. But while you guys are hitting that like button, I'm going to go ahead and splat to my desk so we can see exactly what type of lobby this is. We're spectating Taylor3921. Um, Man, while I'm spectating, I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you to all the people who have been watching my content. Uh, over the past week, I've had the best week I've ever had in my YouTube history. And just look at some of these numbers and... This all comes from you guys, man. But enough of the sappy crap. We're into the we're into the gunfight here. Taylor has two people on him. It looks like one person just died near him, and he he's trying to get in it, man. So he has a he's a rival nine. He has an SVA. He's some pretty decent guns. It looks like he's going to go fight. So let's see what he does here. On top of the roof, he now has high ground. He wants even higher ground. See this personally right here. I don't know. I don't know what he's doing here. Oh, so. Okay, he sees another one flying into his left. Of course, he sees a dude getting shot off from the... He mounts. Broke armor on that. Oh, one shot! Oh, hope he had more ammo. He'd probably get that kill. See, a lot of people are, are shooting his gun. They're tapping it, but they're not putting it in a single fire. So that whole tap fire thing with the SVA does not work if you're not putting it in single fire. You don't get the damage boost. Close the door from the bomb drone because, you know... Oh, there's a window right there. There's another guy over. Oh my god, he's there's so many people near him right now. Oh, 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 oh. oh headshots for Taylor. Good shots for him. Good shot from the right. Hey, this is so many people over here. He sees them down below. Remember, mini map. They they do have a new feature where right there on the mini map on the left side of the screen, you see that his screen has red around the mini map, letting him know there's a UAV in the area. He sees a lot of people over here. Just a little coaching moment right here, a little coaching moment. People use your mini map. There's a lot of times people think somebody's cheating and they just don't know that they can use a mini map right now. Great shots. Great shots from Taylor. This guy Taylor's actually not terrible. He's not that bad of a person. Not that bad of a player. Use your mini map. When you see red dots on the mini map, there's going to be an arrow either above or below that person. And that tells you if they're above you or if they're below you. Simple as that. All right. So he doesn't see anybody in his immediate vicinity. So he's just, you know, free to run around. Personally, I, I would go for that. I would go for that zip line. Yep. Looks like that's what he's going to do. He's going to go for that zip line and then zip over to his loadout. Oh, my God. Somebody on a zip line. He's being hunted. He's a three threat right now. He heard somebody drop smoke down to his left behind him. He's getting shot at. Oh, he made it. Woo. I hate getting shot at by Zipla. Let me know down in the comments down below. Like, what is your favorite part or the most the thing you hate most about this game? Like, getting shot at on a zip line is terrible. He sees one to his right. He must have high alert because I didn't see that guy. He sees one somebody throwing a loadout right here. So he needs to get into a good spot, good position. Using the HRM9, so a meta a meta SMG. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! See, you gotta be he he didn't check his corners. He saw the plate box right there and he didn't use his knowledge. No, okay. That means there's somebody at least in this building. If there's a plate box here, they had to throw that down recently. Now we're looking at J Die, who has three kills to his name. Somebody slide in. He, oh, pre fire. One of them against a demon right here. The demon just <laughs> the demon just straight up pooped on him. Ika, Ichika, 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 Ikasha, Tikaka, Ishikaka. I don't know. I I'm a, I'm gonna call him Icky. Icky with the kill. Dude has five kills. He has Borealis. He has the great camos. He's Y Wying at the Ram Seven and the HRM Nine. This okay. We found the demon at the lobby. We found okay. Drop shotting. Hitting all the shots. We have found the demon of the lobby. Okay, we found him. He's just 
shooting bodies. Not only is he a demon, he's toxic. Like, this is why they need to up the player count in VR. Because 39 people left in solos in second circle is ridiculous. Like, they, they definitely... Type in the comments down below if you guys think they need to up the player count. Because this, this player count is just not high enough. It's just not. He hears more people shooting up there on the hill. Is he going to fly towards that to help those guys? Or is he going to just go inside a circle? Let's say he's going to go inside a circle. Flying above. Nobody at this bot station. Okay. You Once again, you see right there on his mini-map, there's a red line around his circle, which means somebody has a UFV on him. All right. He wanted to make sure nobody's in there. Nobody was in there. Save that. This guy is very aggressive. He's he's a very aggressive player. All right, we're back. We're back over here with Ichka, man. He he's back over here at Old Town, still Y Ying. He's been Y Ying for like five minutes. All you hear is do 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 do. Oh, he sees one flying right towards him. Free kill. Yeah, that was the freest kill ever. So unfortunate. <laughs> he said that's so unfortunate. <laughs> it definitely is, bro. <laughs> so I can tell by what he just did right there. He doesn't know the BR map just yet He must be playing resurgence ranked or something like that because they made changes in this new season to where they move the buy stations and things Because there, there used to be a buy station right there And it, it even took me a second cloud thought okay He's going to the buy station, but no, there's no buy station right there anymore It's gonna move the buy stations so you can tell that's why he went there. He looked at it. and said, like, oh never mind It's not a buy station anymore and then more away <laughs> Man, let me know down in the comments down below. Do you guys like these new buy station changes or do you hate them? Do you think they should have left the buys where they were? Personally, I feel like they should have left the buy station where they were and just added more. Like, just add more buy stations. I don't know why it's a big deal to... Like, why you have to move them around. Just add more, you know? People can't buy stations and stuff, so just add more buy stations. Pops UAV. That was a smart tactic to slide as he was hitting the buy. You can slide and hit the buy at the same time. So that way, if somebody is trying to snipe at you, you sliding, hitting the buy real quick, you'll be able to, you know, make it a little bit harder for people to snipe you. Okay, he sees one right there on his mini map. That dude caught in a PA. He knows he's above, so he's probably on top of that roof. He's above him. He sees me. He can shoot through that right there. Nice. Good shots. Ah, nope. He jumped down. Oh, he's still up there. Personally, he would have downed him if he would have shot through the ram. Okay, now he's just going to leave him. Oh, missed shots. Bad aim assist. This could be it. This is, the, this is the battle between a really good player. Oh, he got landed on by somebody else. Oh, free kill. Nice. He didn't get that kill, though. He's already weak by somebody else. He knows he has to move. He's probably going to jump off to the left or to his right. Oh, he's going to jump at somebody else here. Oh, this guy's good. He, he just instantly smokes. This guy's a good player. All right. Mark one enemy. He's going to keep flowing and going. Keep flowing and going. He does have enough to get another UAV. Does he make his way towards that bot for UAV or nah? No, he doesn't. I mean, he knows it. So, okay, so the dude who flew over here did just pop a UAV. So he knows he's on UAV right now. Yep, there he is. Once again, use your mini map. That it, a red outline went around his mini map. And he, so now he knows he's on UAV. And he saw the guy flying in. Like, it's, it's small stuff like that. You knew that the guy flying over in that area probably went and bought a UAV. The second you see that 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 red line, you know, okay, I'm on UAV. So you know he's gonna look dead at you. You know he can see you. So get the cover ASAP. Like th these are the small tips and tricks that people need to use to make themselves better players. Oh my God, lining up his crosshairs. This guy is a very good player. Yep, switch guns. Smoke to get across. Yep. So that way, man, this guy, he's a very good tactical player. He doesn't have the best shots, but as far as like the way he plays is very good. Using his movement to his advantage, picking up this man, looting. It's, we're, 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 we're expecting a very good player here. Top 10 situation, top nine situation now. This guy's like Tim Duncan. This guy is like Tim Duncan. He's just very te technically sound, bro. So somebody above him, he hears him above him. I don't want this guy to die, but if he doesn't, okay. Inside the house now. This guy's crosshair placement, his 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 centering is really good. 
There's a hop up. He can do this hop up. Will he though? Or he just no, don't waste a PA. He just do the hop up. Requesting he wasted a PA. Look here. Sheesh. He almost got that kid. He's been fighting the same guy all match. <laughs> nice! Nice! Let's go! He's been fighting that guy all match, bro. <laughs> all match, bro. He was fighting that guy. That guy was annoying, bro. But they, it was it was the battle of two juggernauts, bro. They both were really technically sound and really good players, man. Well, here's one close to him. In that building, is two people fighting. Take advantage of that. Boom, right there. One's dead. Another one's weak. Take a boom right there across. Simple. Like I said, he doesn't have the best shots, but he's just super technically sound. He uses the drop shots. He uses everything he does right here. If it's me, I'm picking up that ghost vest. So that way you're no longer on UAV. You want to try to find some type of divot or something. Some so you can have a heady and cover in these open circle. He does have this building, but he has to come out of that building. I guarantee that little street sign right there that you can climb up on, somebody's over there. Somebody's probably on top of that street sign. If I had to guess. See, right now, he could, like, boom. He, he sees one right there in front of him. Yep. Easy shots. All right, so he has that. He doesn't know where the second guy is. It's a 1v1v1 situation. He needs to know where the second guy is. He wants to stay moving because one of them probably has a sniper. Most likely in solos, people have a sniper. So you want to break the distance. This is a nice divot to cut you off from the person on the right. Now he's looking at the guy on his left. Well, he didn't look at the guy. He didn't clear his left. He didn't clear his left. He's in the middle of the circle and did not clear. He's focusing this guy on the right. This is this is something he should not do, right? Focusing this guy on the right. He knows he's here. He knows he's there. But he has no idea where the second guy is. He's just going to full send this guy on the right. Yep, now he's going to shot up from the third person. Oh, my God. They're both over here to the right. No, they're not. Okay. He's getting smoked towards a portal radar. Throw that down. Oh, hit man. This guy should win. 11 kills in the wind. He's getting pushed from the left. Close in the UAV. Right there. Season right there. Good shot by that guy. Nice way to use his cover of this building. This guy is just so technically sound, bro. And he gets the shot to get the win. Like, oh my God. We just watched a Tim Duncan of Warzone win this game. Get this guy, bro. This guy. This is. This this guy just showed us how to win a Warzone game, bro. If you guys like if you guys like this type of video, if you guys like more specs and content, make sure you guys like the video. Comment down below if you think you guys can beat you can beat this guy in a one v one, and subscribe to the channel for more. All right. That means said it's your boy Stu, and I catch y'all in the next video. Peace.